What's up guys, this is VIP Access and I'm very honored to be sitting here with Winky D, an amazing artist who represents the genre of dancehall and reggae and from Zimbabwe. How are you Winky D? Blessed, it's a great pleasure having you here. It's a great pleasure to see you and I really love your hairstyle. Tell me about this, how long are your dreads? A uh, good 14 years now. When we listen, to, when we think of Zimbabwe, we think of the likes of Oliver Mtukuzi, also Ja Praiza, who was on Coke Studio last season. And it's amazing to meet other artists from Zimbabwe and who are also singing different genres. So um, tell me about the music scene in Zimbabwe. What are the sounds you guys are listening to? What are people feeling um, in the streets? Well, we have uh, different genres, so to speak. Yes, we have hip hop, we have dance, the Afro beats. But the most dominant right now is dancehall. Even though we as Zimbabweans have actually captured dancehall and we have fused it and we have put our own feel into it, and now we are calling it Zim dancehall, meaning Zimbabwean dancehall, yeah, which is actually different from the dancehall from Jamaica and yeah. Fantastic. And uh, which artists are you collaborating with on Coke Studio? This is your first time on the show. Um, it's not over yet. So what can you say about your experience on the show so far? Well, the experience is really great, you know, getting to meet uh, people from different backgrounds, you know, different cultures, different type of vibe. Well, it's a really a great experience, you know, sharing ideas. Uh, it's really great, you know. And also, uh, in Zimbabwe, you've been asking about the, uh, the artists and the genres that we are doing. Yeah, we have uh, quite a number of artists who are doing pretty well in, in Zimbabwe. Yes, we have uh, the Killer Tees, we have the Amara Browns, we have the Takura. Yeah, quite a number of artists are doing great vibes right now. So far, what are the next projects that we should expect to see from Winky D? Any collaborations that are coming with other artists? And now that you're in East Africa, any plans to do some songs with some East African artists? Yeah, we are, we are very much open to working with everybody right now, yeah. It's, rather, it's just that the program has rather been tied from studio to hotel, studio to hotel, but right now after this is done, yeah, we'll just explore and discover and get to work with some of the artists that we have seen. Uh, whilst I'm here. What's the biggest thing you've learned or enjoyed about Coke Studio so far? The interaction, yeah, the, the, uh, the integration also. Um, we as artists getting to understand how the music thing is happening here in Kenya uh, from the guys uh, from Uganda, guys from Tanzania, guys from Mozambique, even guys from Nigeria getting to understand how the music fraternity is actually kicking and going in their countries, yeah, sharing the ideas and stuff. It's a pleasure to meet you Winky D. I wish you all the best on Coke Studio and even beyond Coke Studio. And now that you've come to Kenya and East Africa, I'm hoping to see some collaborations coming from you with our artists. And uh, now it's my time to go and discover you and listen to more of your music. Anything you want to tell your fans who are watching you? A blessed. I just want to big up all those who have been supporting Winky D from all over the world. It's, it has been a great pleasure, I know. We will never stop bringing up the vibes. It's just expect more, bigger, better and greater things from Winky D in the year 2019. She extra bang. It's a wrap from VIP Access. Next week, I will be speaking to many other of your favorite celebrities. Ciao.